What's going on guys? It's Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer and after a weekend off I'm back with another The Division Weapon Review. Today our reviews 62 through 64 as I will be covering the Hazmat, EMT, and JTF P416 assault rifles. But before we get into the review, here are some basic stats and weapon info for you on the P416. The country of origin is the United States of America. The rate of fire is 750 rounds per minute. The magazine size is 30 rounds. The fire type is full auto and the reload speed is somewhere around 2.30 seconds. Founded in 2002 by aerospace engineer Frank DeSoma, POF USA was the first manufacturer and seller of gas piston operated weapon systems in the US. Headquartered in Phoenix, Arizona, Patriot Ordnance Factory set about trying to solve two common problems with gas impingement systems in dusty conditions, carbon fouling and a short barreled timing issue. To address these two issues, POF developed the regulated short-stroke gas piston system. Through their proprietary designs, POF virtually eliminated carbon fouling, allowing the weapon to run much cooler and it's considerably more reliable and safer to use. For those players who purchased the season pass, the National Guard, Paramedic, and Hazmat gear sets were given as early access bonuses and included three different customized versions of the P416 assault rifle. These standard level 4 weapons are available for pickup at the rewards claim vendor downstairs in your base of operations and are one part of a six item gear set for each branch which include a hat, jacket, pants, backpack, boots, and these specialized weapons. The EMT P416 is a standard version of the weapon except for blue tape wrapped around the magazine with the writing EMT and the number 1. The JTF P416 comes with the Gold Edition and is part of the National Guard gear set and features a gray-green digital camo skin on the main body of the weapon. The final weapon is the Hazmat P416, which is a reward for pre-ordering the game and features a honeycomb skin and orange tape around the magazine with the writing H4. I will not be giving each of these ARs a thorough review as I already reviewed both the military and G3 variants of this AR in previous reviews. However, the base stats of 36 accuracy, 39 stability, and an optimal range of 26 meters are all fairly strong, and the fire rate of 750 rounds per minute is higher than normal for this classification of weapon. For a player looking for a little extra firepower early in their campaign, this trio of specialty weapons are not bad, and I would recommend you check your vendor to see if they are waiting for you. I'm going to rate the Hazmat, EMT, and JTF P416 assault rifles a 3 out of 5 stars. It is difficult to rate them as a player just starting their campaign as most of us have progressed up to gear score 204 and higher weaponry, and have quickly forgotten what it's like trying to buy and source weapons as a rookie. These specialty P416s do pack some punch for such an early weapon, but the bloom or spread when firing full auto is too severe to maintain accurate full auto fire at anything past close to medium distances. As always, I would like to hear your thoughts on this weapon and my review. Feel free to leave your opinions in the comment section below. In addition, if you could take the time to rate the video with a thumbs up or down, it would be appreciated. I will leave a link in the description below to my entire The Division Weapon Review playlist and check back daily for my newest reviews. Remember from my channel, likes, comments, subs are loved. Until next time, this has been Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer saying peace out.